Next question. Mm -hmm. What is in it for a corporate member? I, I want to understand more about the corporate membership. Thank you so much. So we spoke about individual members. Now we've also got corporate partnerships with our corporate companies within the insurance industry because we cannot do this on our own as the ISA. Because the mandate is to ensure that we provide skills development for the industry and we enhance the knowledge of the individuals within the industry. Mm -hmm. So we work very closely with our corporate partners. So as a corporate partner, as a group, so mm -hmm. what you get as a group, over and above those benefits that I've mentioned that now talk to the individuals within your group, mm -hmm. as a corporate partner, we also offer you the opportunity to showcase your brand. Oh, yes. So we would um, profile you as an organization because we've got a network of individuals within our social media space or any different platforms that we offer. So you would have access to all of our members. So brand awareness, we profile you. Yes. We would profile you also as a thought leader. Mm -hmm. So you will share your expertise with the industry through our magazine, Beyond Insurance magazine. Yes. So we profile you as a thought leader, as a corporate. We also work very closely with you in terms of your CPD content if you want us to assist you in building or putting together your CPD content as, 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 as a corporate partner, we do that. We also assist uh, um, in terms of your career development. Yes. So if you've got career days within your organization, so we could be there to also speak to your, to, to, to your employees on skills development, on different opportunities within the industry, and we could also bring in other subject matter experts who will then share their expertise with your, with, with, with your individuals within the corporate partner. Mm -hmm. And of, of course, the CPD management for the group, oh, yes. because now individuals can manage their own, but also as the group or as, an, as a corporate, you would also want to manage the CPD for, for, for your staff. Yes, yes. So your compliance, compliance officer or whoever who's responsible for for the CPD management, so they can do that for the group. Oh, okay. And you have access to your account, meaning to your profile yes, within, yes. Our, within our space. So through, you don't even have to come directly to us because you would have access to to, to, to your corporate profile. No, oh, yes. You can easily check the compliance of your team. You can easily update and remove other members who have left your organization. So there's a self-regulation of your membership profile within our system as the corporate partner. Mm -hmm. So those are um, some of the other benefits Advances. that, uh, yeah, the value propositions that you get when you say what it's in, in for me as an organization. And of course, you get a group discount to the conference. Oh, brilliant. Yes. And you get group discounts for your webinars, for your individuals when they attend our webinars. Oh, so that okay. is also a benefit. You also get an opportunity to showcase your brand through our webinars. Okay. So you might have not done it through the magazine, but then you can conduct a webinar yes. on your topical matters or what you, you are what you know maybe it's an expertise within that space oh yeah so we give an opportunity also to to elevate your brand in that space and share your expertise yes so there are a number of benefits for being a corporate, corporate. Yeah. and corporate membership is not limited to the big insurers yes. it's also to your your, your your smaller companies that are brokerages that are starting oh, out that's true. that's true so brokers small brokers and all of those who are small, medium, large, corporate, UMAs, insurers, brokers, yes. everyone can become a corporate member because you get a value proposition that is tailor-made to your needs. Oh, yes. So everyone can become a, bro can become a, a corporate partner of the IIS. So you now know that if you've started your brokers, brokerage and you're still wondering where to fit yourself in, this is one place you need to start. Speaking about small brokerages and small businesses, is there anything you as the ISA actively do towards you know, equipping them or empowering um, those SMEs? We do, we do. 
So we've got a program that we run for brokers. Mm -hmm. So where we're partnering with brokers and we are looking for more brokers to join us, please. Why we do that, it is our primary focus to ensure that we advance the professionalism within the insurance space. So brokers who are startups, brokers who are already emerging, they also could become, they could benefit from this program that we're running for the broker partnership that we're currently running. Yes. And through the broker uh, partnership, there's a number of things that we're offering for, for the brokers. Marketing support, mm -hmm. compliance support, skills training, yes. and also skills training would include a number of things. Business acumen training, compliance training, business ethics, how to run your, 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 your brokerage, how to run your organizations, and a number of things. So mm. there's a lot. So we please, if they need to engage, please engage with us so that we can unpack our value propositions to the brokers. And I also maybe engage with you just to get like, a, if they need to provide a link or if they need to email somebody. Yes. We'll then provide a link and then who, who they could speak to. It's sitting within um, marketing department space okay. so, and a business development. So the that's where you get more information when it comes to our broker partnership package. So it's not a one size fits all. Oh, so yes. each package will be tailor made based on the needs of that particular broker and membership. So we always ensure that we, we build a package that will speak to your your kind of business yes. and your needs as well. And I've seen like in, in previous years, you've also ran sort of, you know, campaigns to say to brokers that don't have affordability to go to Sun City for, for the conference, that you'll then fund um, their ticket to come to the conference as well, as a way to, because the conference does expand your net network as well. Exactly, exactly. So that's why I'm saying brokers could engage with us and, and see what package we build for the brokers. Mm -hmm. So if your need is, yes, I want to be out there, I need to network, because it's also one of our, of our benefits to, to members, business networking. Yes. And we offer those opportunities to do that in terms of the package that we offer to, to brokers over and about training, mm -hmm. executive management program, director training. So those are the things that brokers need. Yes. And then we work around that. And of course, we invite them to also let us know what are their needs, because we don't want to build a program that excludes them. Oh, yes. And it's for them. Yes. yes. So it's very important also to engage and say, okay, this, this is our pain points. Then we build a, a program that speaks to such requirements so corporate mem membership is done and dusted i think if you need any information in terms of joining as a corporate member or as an individual member you need to just go down below i'll provide the link but thank you so much for your time Ms. Kopano. uh it was really difficult it's taken me a year <laughs> to sit down with this lady but finally it's happened so thank you so much you're and welcome Amanda. i can't wait to engage with you further this year let's do that Perfect. All right. Please if you like this space. video, if you like this video, click subscribe, like it, and then tell your friends, your cousins, and everybody else to just subscribe and watch it. I'll see you in the next video.